Hi, welcome to see you again. This time we will try to make a plug-in by ourselves. Before we start, of course, we have to make an IMA project first. Make an application by clicking on the Get Started button, fill in the required data, then save. So, please fields such as application names, application descriptions, author information and more. Next, we will set the backend configuration, especially the table and column data. Follow me down, there's no one around. Lay back and take your socks and shoes right off. That natural light is so damn polite. Here, I will create a table like vocabulary for the verb. So I just made the name oh. verb. The icon used by WordPress is dash icons. And we click the add new table button. And then we will make the columns needed for vocabulary. For options we must check JSON list and JSON details. You turn toward me and look so we Variable as value and variable label must also be specified. This is used for HTML select, which is used by other tables. Now, we arrange it to be more suitable. Next, we will create a plugin file using the WP plugin generator. Fill in all the information needed, like plugin name, plugin description, folder for test and WordPress URL. It's so damn polite. Previously, we had to install like WordPress on a local machine, so we can use the live test. So, we can copy the folder address from the root WordPress. Standing on 
And this is the result. You can download it or test it directly into WordPress. Let's see the results in WordPress. Come on, we activate it and we try it. Now, we check the RESTful API made by this generator. Like you were young again. Standing underneath the rows of trees, you can see where the ocean meets the sky. Life of running wild. You're running wild underneath 